I do live around here. My house is only over there. Hey, Alright, sir. All right. so, is this your wife's partner? No, what's the problem? He's taken my phone and I, I have you, to I give him my name. his phone on, on what grounds? On the grounds that I want I to speak to you. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. One second. Well, sorry, just one moment, just one moment. So can you tell me why you've taken the lady's phone? Can you tell me why you've taken the lady's phone please? Officer 1453, can you please tell me why you've confiscated this lady's phone? Are you a police officer? Yes, I am. Yeah. Would you like to identify yourself? I'm not. You're not. As, you're not part of this. So I don't need to. Yeah. So you know, I. I What's the reason for taking um, your phone? Because, because it might be used to hamper our investigation into the, whatever we're dealing with. Okay. Have you asked them what they're dealing with? Something yes. to do with swing being taken. Oh, sure. Right, and how are you implementing that? How are you implementing that? Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me! That's against the law! You're breaking the law, I'm allowed to film here! This is a public area and you're a public servant! Do not touch me, you have no right to my phone like that, sir! Please don't touch me, please stop following me, you're not allowed to touch me here! You're not allowed to touch me, officer! Please stop touching me! Please stop touching me! Touching you, my hands are here! Why are you still coming towards me? Please, please, I have moved away! I have moved away, I feel very harassed and intimidated here! Please stop this! I'm allowed to be here, I'm allowed to film you, you're a public servant operating in a public place. You have no right to touch me and to grab my phone like that, please don't do it. Stay away, uh, have nothing to do with it. Why have you decided to stick your nose into something that's... Because, because that's my right. That's my right. I'm helping this, stick your this, nose into something I'm helping this person here. She's a neighbour of mine. You're not your fence. Obstruct a constable in the ex Who am I obstructing? You're always walking towards me. I'm trying to stop. And you keep walking towards me. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. You're not helping the person. Please stop. Yes, you've, you've come to the phone. I'm asking why. This is this is this is this is right. This is harassment. I feel I feel very I feel very harassed by you. Please stop walking towards me. I feel very intimidated. Please, can you stop this? Please, can you stop walking towards me? You've already 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 you So I have every right to film, it's a public area. Okay. And ultimately, if it contains evidence of offence, we might have every right to seize your phone. That's holding that evidence. Okay, but I know I haven't committed an offence. No, no, but, you know. Anyway. You're not, you're not, as, you're not part of this, I don't know. Nothing to do with you. Nothing to do with you. There's nothing to do with you. The reason why I want your details is because an offence may have been committed. Certain times in your life, a police officer may require your details. There's no point being silly about it. These people here, who are equally in the frame for whatever is going on, quite happily provided all their details. Yeah. No, I know what I'm, 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 I'm,
sitting within the law. And it's lawful of us. If we but if so am I to, to, to stand next to her and film, it's quite, it's quite that's, 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 that's quite lawful as well. If we are dealing with an incident, especially as traffic officers with vehicles on the road, we have a duty to make sure everyone's lawful and legal. Okay. So and why, part of that why seize a phone way. and go for all that though? That's what I'm saying. That's that's the part I don't like a bit. Because that's not lawful, is it? So, you know, and it's not and it's not moral, moral, is it? But we don't we didn't know we didn't even need to go there. Well yes yes you did, because you are still using a vehicle on the road. And it's a lawful requirement if an officer requests to see your license, insurance and MOT. If you don't produce them, then you need to provide your date of birth. And if you don't do that, then it is an offence. It's, it's as simple as that, it's not, it's not rocket science. But I wasn't using the vehicle for that. You are, because you're trying to sell it. Even though you're not driving it, you're still using it. As the owner of that vehicle, you're still using it because it's being driven on the road. You're giving someone else permission to drive. But the, the there's a, the thing, there's the a thing called use law. We can discuss this all day with it, because it's what we do. There's a thing called use There's a thing called use cause law. law. Okay? As the owner of the vehicle, you, you use the vehicle. Yeah. If you if you permit somebody to use a vehicle, you're still using and they're, they're, they've been permitted to use it. And there's also a thing called cause law. It doesn't with Jet Public it doesn't really come into it. It's, normally that is a business thing, causing somebody to use a vehicle. If you know, for instance, a car's got defective tyres and you say to your boss, I'm sorry I'm not going to drive that because I've got defective tyres and he says, well if you don't get in there and drive it now, you're going to get sacked. He's caused somebody to then use it. But nothing like that's that happened. No, no, that's right. But it's, I think what you're saying is there's no need for all the heavy handedness taking a phone off her and all that sort of thing. That, that's, that's what we don't right, approve right, of in the force. You know, that's, that's, that's what I'm saying. Taking the phone off, off um, Charlotte was because it's, it's she bullying made from where I come from. It's make a call, call, call that might hamper our investigation. Okay. If I think our investigation is going to be hampered, by, like you could be saying, the roses are here, get out the back. Couldn't you? Flush the loo, flush the loo. Or get the gun and shoot. We don't know, do we? All right. Had it before. But yeah. that's a joke. I've had that before. Yeah. And, and you no, if you didn't I come for her, and uh, I, I see it's you exactly weak. People get, do not know get the uniform on, and they start getting, you know. You're not removing a sweep from a tree, they climb the tree whilst people were loitering outside the house. Anyway, if your house was subject to somebody breaking into it, some kindly neighbour rang us and we attended. And the person who was outside your address at the time. You'd probably detain all of us, oh, like, I expect. You can quite yeah. clearly yeah. see he's not out burgling and swinging on trees. That's what I was saying. It's common Thank sense. You. If the police attended and there's somebody outside the address, like you all were, and somebody said, oh, I'm not giving the police my name, and we said, alright, thank you very much, have a nice day, you would be really pissed off, wouldn't you? And you'd probably complain that we hadn't conducted a thorough well, investigation. Even, but then I, I'd expect you to be arresting me for suspicion That's it. Of Arrest them and then find out the details. Yeah. What? For suspicion of what? Yeah, on the There you go. <laughs> exactly. Thank you. <laughs> She's just said it. No She's, you're agreeing with her. But I have grounds for us your details. Alright? I think we'll get that around the same. Yeah, I think so.